bitch. Smell like money. What yeah. are you talking about? What's up? Uh, smell it on us. What are you talking about? You can smell it on us, nigga. Is this thing on? This is the HOD. This Awards. is the HOD Awards where we're here to hand out your trophies. You jump the gun. So you jump the gun. Can't jump the gun in the HOD Awards. Now that's where you fucked up. That's where you fucked up in your list. That's where you fucked up in life. <laughs> Finna give you a bucket, nigga. Who we got first round? We're getting right into it. SpongeBob versus Rugrats. All right, bro. Longevity. SpongeBob Adam. Are you sure? Yes. Longevity of good quality content years because Rugrats nine seasons deep plus girl. We were up there, dem but we were their demographic through all nine years. I'm saying nobody watches the younger demographic. It's still weird out by SpongeBob. Eh. The new episodes where they got hippie shit and gross looking content. It's weird enough. For all, us, all grown you're up, 21 out years old, my nigga. But with Rugrats, all grown up, it's more more seasons than SpongeBob. It is a better show, holistically. I'm going to get conceived. Yeah, that was a better show because, like you said, you could watch Rugrats right now and you could give a kid Rugrats right now and he'll enjoy it. You give a kid a kid the SpongeBob while he might enjoy it. An uh, old head isn't going to enjoy it based off how good the old SpongeBob was. And Rugrats was, like, you can give him any episode. It's any like, fucking episode. It's still, there's always morals. and, and uh, <laughs> Like I said, there's always morals. <laughs> <laughs> Rugrats got the best morals in the straight. <laughs> Rugrats fuck the game up. All right. Next round. Well, we won't tell them more, man. SpongeBob, you're still awesome. I fuck with you. But y'all niggas fell off. It fell off because there was different creators uh, that, that moved in. There was different, um, you know, the design team, the director team. They really switched up. It really changed the whole thing. You know, and... Got in a new bag. I'm not a fan. Of. It made it made it weird just because you know they made SpongeBob a little more fruity and they didn't make. Uh, Why did SpongeBob got to be fruity? He was never really that fruity. He was just sort of yeah. fruity. And it you was, know what I mean? It was a difference. And Squidward, but that's very insensitive to say. I'm not going to keep saying that word, fruity. Okay. Islands of Die Network denounces the it term was just fruity. Goofy, you know, it, it's like he's acting goofy, and, and it's like no. Yeah, we gonna just go ahead and get him off this uh, subject of the fruity sponge. Well, he's a little bit of a cake though. Okay. Anyway, <laughs> iCarly versus Tom and Jerry. It's that new school. I, new school. Oh, versus, oh, it's good dynamic. <laughs> I gotta go with iCarly, bro. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, bro. That shit was hot as fuck. And at this point, I've taken out all bias. I'm looking at these things as just for what the shows were, bro. iCarly was my shit, and I feel like it was the shit of niggas to the point that. Man, I might have took a bullet for Carly. That's what niggas didn't know. I might have took one. In her prime? In her prime. In her prime 2012 season? <laughs> what are you talking about, bro? In her prime, I would have You seen how Tristan Thompson just tricked off a whole playoff for that ass. Off Sam. And probably did have a threesome with the iCarly gang. Damn. And then he over here living out all our childhood fantasies at 40. It's creepy ass. That's why you can't win without LeBron, Tristan. You over here to being a pervert. Draymond. You know that was Draymond. never in your... It, that was never in your bag. Why do you fantasize about iCarly? You was grown as fuck when they came out. That's more of our bag. He's not too... Drummond? Andre Drummond from the Pistons. Oh, I thought it was Tristan Thompson. No, that's... That's a... Uh, oh, no, I ain't gonna say that about Drummond, nigga. Kendall got... uh Simmons. She should went with the winner. But Kendall also had Andre Drummond teammate, Blake Griffin. That's somebody. Is the Where? Kardashian, Kardashian curse real? Hell yeah. Go ahead and go get your pussy on good and still be focused. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about, bro? You not. <laughs> Never leave the house. <laughs> nigga, I'm in that. Bitch. What you talking about practice, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> Work out. <laughs> hey, uh, you mean we out the playoffs? I didn't show up once. <laughs> Game seven. <laughs> you was, I didn't even watch that bitch. I was watching it on TV. I thought it was the it was the highlights. Oh, this was a flashback episode. But now nah, we're going with iCarly. I don't know about you. I'm going with iCarly heavy. <laughs> <laughs> uh. 
<laughs> okay, we gotta chill out on this one. Get this podcast wrong. Um, Tom and Jerry is a classic, though. You saying like probably classic, classic, platinum, 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 platinum. Oh. All right, bro, we gotta chill. Holy fuck! <laughs> Smell like bombs. Yeah, they shouldn't have to hurt. <coughs> but anyways, I'm a pussy. Anyways, niggas, this bitch lightheaded. All of us just be taking you. Just be on some I'll stuff. take you there. You gotta be center front. Oh, yeah. Okay. No, nah, I'll be getting into my bag. <laughs> but you knew all out of friends. <laughs> I'll be <been>. psychologically. <laughs> to let them know that you're actually winning the argument. Man. Man. Tilt yeah. your chair. <laughs> you gotta look me in my eyes, pussy. <laughs> all right. <laughs> okay. Tom and Jerry classic. I Carly, I fuck with you. You know, you did have the, the guy making the smoothies. I fuck with you too. Uh, and then the smoothie Johns. He yeah. made I Carly made it okay for young niggas to get smoothies. We were on the fence about it. What was the streets? We was like, we it's really didn't want to be healthy, but we it's not that we didn't want to be it, it's niggas gonna be looking at me crazy if I pop out with this smoothie. I didn't so know pink shit. You see, got pink Exactly. And back then, you know, that's when niggas was on their blue too. Okay. You know, men like to wear blue in the back and they got boys. Boys. All right, Drake and Josh versus Ed and Eddie. Wait, who's so who won? I Carly? I Carly definitely got me through. I Carly <laughs> picking something up, but we can go Tom and Jerry. So. Hello, Key. So they don't know because we're getting our silent bag too. All right, hold on. Let's talk about silent bag. Silent movie. Okay, ready? Set. Killed it. Anyway, <laughs> next bag. <laughs> All right, we're back into it. I had to take a little phone call. There's a couple cuts in this episode. But we get going into the next round. Drake and Josh versus Ed and Eddie. Fuck that, Ed and Eddie. Fuck that. Fuck that. Ed and Eddie, bro. Come on. We're the new Drake and Josh. We is the new Drake and Josh, but come on. We the new Ed and Eddie, too. Double D. Double D? Let me be Eddie. Let me be Eddie. Eddie was a stupid motherfucker. <laughs> I don't want to be a stupid motherfucker. You can be Eddie. Yeah. No, you could be uh, Double D. And then Eddie was that shit. And see, you, once you Double D, now you in a whole different type of bag. That really is my bag. And that really is your bag. <laughs> but Drake and Josh, you know, we <laughs> fuck with you. We fuck with you, but you ain't talking It's about just, that. you know, we really just needed you for your green and blue lines that were so far. Now we in our, uh, who was we? Ed, Ed and Eddie back. We all yeah. about collecting your bag. Back. <laughs> Man, Drake is getting these jawbreakers popping. Uh, think about our, we think could. about where we could take this. Because we really were businessmen. Ex- oh, now niggas starting to be an Ed and Natty bag. What are you talking about? Double D. Let me get you the hat. Okay. <laughs> and let me get my glove back. I'll be in my OJ bag. There go your hat, my right hand. Okay. Bring your double D bag. See, Spill Milk, what you don't know about my man Spill Milk is he a method actor. So he can hop into a hundred different bags. A lot of bags. Nah, yo, Double D have a little bit of that jump hanging out soon. I don't know. But you gotta have it like touching the top. Oh. I don't know how he used to do that. <laughs> Dummy relaxer. Used to perm his shit. <laughs> double D had the first perm. What are you talking about? Okay, next list. Well, we respect Rick and Josh for creating. Everybody the gets their respect. We don't have to do that shit after every. Everybody knows they get respect. All Fuck right. them. So we went on one versus Hannah <laughs> Montez. Man, so we went on one picking that ball up and running with it. Oh, uh, these only one on one like <laughs> because it was what Hannah Montana should have been. Should have been for the streets. <laughs> So we went on one with Hannah Montana for the streets, and I got the OJ glove, so I can really pop out and it know. fit. Well, because Zoe went on one, you wanted to be at that school, and it was we, like we was already gonna do the pick and roll on Zoe. Pick and roll. With Zoe didn't five, know about what you do with a good little pick and roll. Just, I, we'd be spending the night at the girls' dorm, sneaking in there under there under the bed, and I had a shoulders to <laughs> I be selling these shoulders out that bitch. They ain't never seen the girls <laughs> dorm full of goons. <laughs> they gotta respect us, all right? <laughs> they got a shotgun in that bitch. <laughs> Talk about 
<laughs> no, dog. <laughs> what? This is a pit bull, bitch. <laughs> you got puppies. There's a motherfucking pit bull. Rock wows. Look, we have a Zoe. Motherfucker just. I bet it is. You know it. I'm just bring it up. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga, talk about don't say me. You know me for you gonna be kicked out of this nice ass school club. Y'all can come over as long as we fuck with y'all. It's because the guys there were such pussies. They wasn't trying to be in. They wasn't trying to shoot that. They shot. was trying. Kirby was at nine. Like, all right, all right, we'll stop playing pool now. And well, see, I would have just been smooth. I would have already been in the dorm with a shorty with the hat. Already, already been secured the road, bag by eight thirty two. Already don't even know. <laughs> by the time you think everybody's leaving, we might come into the uh, milk. You got to shake. Yo. Today I'm doing the pick and roll. Throw Tonight, Quinn, Quinn was still in my pocket. Quinn yeah. heard a mixtape yeah. and she started choosing. Niggas wasn't thinking about dropping the mixtape, so Quinn and start choosing. And that would be problem. We dropped the collab out. And then we could have dropped. You hear me? Yeah. <laughs> you hear me, Charlie? With the OJ glove. We could really get in this bitch and drop the collab album with Zoe 101. Think about it. And she was already busting it. And they had the movie. Think about the it. TV she was, show and they had the movie with the phones when they got on the, on the bikes. They was on the lead dirt bike, Papa Willie's, like Big yeah. Melon. We was a They was really the first dream chasers, if you think, <laughs> if you think about it, bro. Because they, them niggas was on the little PCA bikes. Whipping them hoes. Man. I smoked in their room. They long gone though. Anyway. So we went on one. You look. We fucked with you, Harry. But you're going Make against... Uh, nah, who's next? Look, sorry for the hand of Monsanto. You ain't shit, really. Are we it's done like, with the first round with that? Yeah, it's... Now we're going to semis. Semis? Who made it through? Zoe. But this what? Yeah, we're going to the semis now. Yeah, this is before the finals. We go in the uh, Hannah, no, Zoe versus Ed Ed Daddy. Oh. Uh, Rugrats versus iCarly. Okay, that's easy. I'm going iCarly over Rugrats. Fuck that. I've been trying to get these niggas out the paint for a minute. <laughs> iCarly was too for the streets, bro. <laughs> Fuck that. <laughs> iCarly did too much for the streets. You ain't going to discredit Carly, bro. First three seven Elmo. With Freddie in that jump. Since the last Bang metric Rose. was, yeah, we could do the foursome with uh, Ariana Grande too with the salmon cat. And the Miranda. Man. <laughs> it's a budget. Nigga really hey, they got nothing to do with how good these shows are. How <laughs> <laughs> wish we were watching them. Imagine that the whole time. Think about something else. <laughs> <laughs> Watch seven seasons of Icon Girl with you. Okay. So good you learned how to read less. <laughs> I don't really fuck with their message. That's why we didn't know the, the, the guy that makes the smoothies names. Oh, I don't remember. It's Zebo. Oh, yeah, it was Zebo. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I like him. Okay, so uh, I probably miss Rugrats. What you think? Rugrats was really the day one movie. It was a day one job. God, they got longevity. They wow. got all grown up. They got video games. They got Fuck it, I'm switching up. I want Rugrats. Because Rugrats was really, they did have the morals. I probably didn't have too many morals in the story. At least we just trying to fuck with the Really the was just attacking this five so Because Rugrats, you can still watch. But we still like, got Zoe 101. And you going to show your kids Rugrats before I call them. I call them more like a, a, a tween or two. Okay, so next round, who we got? All right. So I went on one versus that that Natty. Man, but that five so long. That five so long. Like, and and as a young nigga, bro, <laughs> <laughs> fuck getting money. <laughs> we was about these hoes. That's some shit you learn with maturity that money's way more important than these hoes. But as a young nigga, all these hoes busting through the crowd. And they were singing the in the intro. And, and they was, and you know I know how to mix and master. Oh, Think about how many. Oh, so you want to be a singer? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, come on, we're going to Now we vibing over coffee. You didn't know I could get in this bag. <laughs> the coffee bag. And now I'm in this bitch talking about, do you like crab rango and sushi? I'm in that bitch too, but let me cook a little something for you. Let me cook a little something. You never well, cook. If you lock in a school, I, you know, I, I relate to a lot because I'm at U of H. So it's pretty much the exact same thing. I went to always, I'm always in these sorority houses and shit. Like, they just sneak me in. 
or they just really be having me after hours at the at the parties that they're not supposed to throw because only the fraternities can throw parties. So it's just really just me and hella bitches. So it's like, uh, I'm really living this only one of life. <laughs> <laughs> That's where you're going with that. <laughs> this is the, oh, Jake Logan, he's so crazy. I was like, yeah, he's okay. <laughs> yeah, I was going with that. What the fuck is this shit even about anymore? Zoe so I want to win. <laughs> Zoe so one versus Rugrats. For the finals? Yeah. Zoe so one won. This fight's going to be so crucial. But fuck that six of you can come to. There's enough bitches to where you can come to when we young, though. We was so young, and it was like, man. Busted out the grill. It was really. And they had nice little beverages that looked so good. And then you oh, remember yeah. when Quinn made that fruit where it was like, oh, oh yeah. That bitch was so And the silent hair. Draw a flyer. Silent hair blower, we gonna, we gonna take that fire. Look, she was in our starter up, man. Oh, we got, cause she got the inventions, but we also, they was making robotics and shit. We got our robotics. I probably would have linked to a Quinn and seen what that shit was talking about. <laughs> Took the glasses off, see what she really was like. Cause you know, you know how them shits be on them Nickelodeon shows. It just take one nigga coming out here from the trap and trying to really change her. See, that's the one thing niggas don't know. If I would have been as only one on one as a child, I wouldn't have been able to change the whole dynamic. First off, boom, Michael, headlock. Oh. First move, pick a roll. Straight to his neck. Yeah. Michael, quick, quick. You see how I connected? Yeah. You see how I did? Right there. Okay. I'm right there with it. I'm right there, Michael. It's because he was too friendly with all the hoes. Uh, and the uh, trying to shoot his shot at all. No, he was in here too busy trying to get off his I'm black bar. Michael must have been from a place where there wasn't many black people. And that's why I think Zoe 101 was written so well. He was. Everybody knows one of these coon, Huckleberry Finn names. Come play sure there's not very many black people, so we go somewhere else and try to get this black boy off. <laughs> he was just talking about getting into the doors and talking to the doors. And then my right. nigga just happened to be goons. Okay. You said the goons. They were my goons. <laughs> my, <laughs> and they, I didn't even say goons. I said, my, I'm going to be in now. I'm going to be telling my niggas if somebody comes, say it's not you, but that ain't my nigga. Well, but like, in your fantasy, there was goons. <laughs> So that's somebody. I ain't even say gold. <laughs> really, really. Not I, think about I did hear that shit. I was like, what that got to do with your <laughs> But you were thinking of it like, hey. What's that nigga was in there just like, man, if I could just be in there with the dream chasers, bro. <laughs> <laughs> What's because I was really going after her roommate, Nicole. Was and the, I wanted the was little bitchy that. one, too. Is that the one who's a, a, a bitch? The bitchy one was the one that showed up goth, but she was in a method acting bag and really. No, so I, I, I would. <laughs> no, the one who she replaced, the one before her. That's my shorty Nicole. She wasn't bitchy. She just was stood her own ground. Fuck Mitch, that. No, 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 you disrespecting Nicole now. <laughs> Fuck that. That's my wifey, dog. Break up with that man you with that little bitch ass husband of yours. She is married now. That's some bullshit. You be <laughs> milk better than be <laughs> As a matter of fact, I'm about, me and Milk are going to go shoot our shot with all the people from Zoe 101. That's why you guys win. Our, our shot we're going to shoot is this video. So if y'all watch to the end Zoe 101, you watch this whole franchise, this whole thing, you'll understand why I'm wearing an OJ glove and why he's got the double D hat on. Yeah. Oh, my bad. Okay. Uh, it's just <laughs> there now. But um, this is Highlands or Die. I hope you enjoyed this content. I win like usual with uh, Zoe 101. With the auto pick that you didn't even want in the beginning with the auto. Ain't that crazy? The Foxy stopped the Nautilus <laughs> line. Sleeper. The Fox something so, <laughs> so vicious. Niggas wasn't even watching the show. <laughs> think about something. Man, you ever been doing some shit, but you think about something completely different? You think about something else? <laughs> you know what I mean? Talking about, man. <laughs> it's like one on one. Good, but I want to. You be a producer. You trying to be in that bag. <laughs> Not because at 13, I really thought all that was stopping me from getting unlimited hoes was I wasn't next to unlimited hoes. That would be a problem. If I had unlimited hoes, though. <laughs> that shit was so unlimited hoes, bro. Because it's just like that board room or board school and shit. Where they they like, need to do that shit with adults, but fuck the school. <laughs> That's what it is. Well, hello. What? That's how you be getting in your bag. The sororities be. Oh, this come up? Bring them in. That come up some fun. I, I cook a little something for it because they don't even, I'll be teaching them how to cook. I'll be like, all right, hold on.
Oh, hold on. I learned this from Casey. I ain't Kitchen. never heard you say "stick a little soap for her" in, in English. Fucking so about. I know. I'll cook a little something for her. <laughs> you was in bunk bags. With bunk bags, so that's why I say for the ladies. So okay, I, t- I learned this on Queso Kitchen. Lowry's drug. Okay, <laughs> first <laughs> cook it with salt, ladies. All right, <laughs> salt is all you need. Fuck that. Love that. Cook a little something. Zoe 101, hottest in the streets. <laughs> Neighborhood classic. Neighborhood hero. <laughs> Motivation for the streets, nigga. <laughs> Winning of the of the the, the Nickelodeon. The Nickelodeon. Hot the hot giant. Nickelodeon uh, did. Cartoon hot. Network superstars. They won. Yeah. They had the hot giant and blood don't fit. That's how they did it in the OJ movie. Nigga had a glove on like this, talk about, uh-uh. I just, uh-uh. You see that? Uh-uh. Well, could we pull then it? He did. It don't work. <laughs> he started doing this shit. It don't go. Okay, let's kill these fuck boy. <laughs> Put on the club. Nigga had this shit like this. <laughs> it don't fit. <laughs> I don't say, uh uh-uh. uh. I couldn't have killed him. Couldn't have been me. Blood the be shrinking when it get wet, but, you know. On the blood. That nigga was Love sick. That. This was the HOD Awards. So, you want to you get this. Trophy. Holla. And I just want to let y'all know, Mimi and Freedom Park is out now. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe if you made it through this in time. Look at your motherfucking t-shirt. Go to www.thespillmillbrand and go get a t-shirt. All the hoes on Zoe 101, hit our DMs. Make so much. Like, drop a like, and subscribe. You know, drop your fucking panties, bitch. Double D bag. Double D bag.